Hey guys, it's couponing Stacy here, and this is my haul from Food for Less today, which is September the 17th. I got kind of too much almost to fit in frame, so I'm definitely not gonna fit in frame. Um, not everything was specifically coupon related deals, but I did do a lot of coupon related deals. If you didn't know, Food for Less is a Kroger affiliate, so we do have the mega sale going on this week at Food for Less as well. And what that is, is spent buy four products that are part of the promo and you save $4 instantly. So for everything here, I spent $59.24, that is with tax and everything. So it was a pretty good deal I saved. 56.60 right there if it will focus so almost 50 percent just under um and i got a lot of food things that i needed um the meat was a good deal so i will go ahead and go over that stuff the meat really quick the chicken so the drumsticks and the um chicken thighs are all included they are 77 cents a pound so the packages were right around three dollars so we picked up five of those then we did the Red Baron deal. This is part of the buy four, save four. So after that, they are $2.49. We have dollar off of two coupons from coupons.com. So it makes them $1.99 each, which is a pretty good deal for frozen pizza. This was just regular price. It was something that we were wanting to play with. I think it was like $1.49 for the can. So not the best deal, but you know, such something to pick up. This is my absolute favorite salad dressing, so I was really excited to find deals for that. So these are part of the promo, the buy four, save four, and after that they are 99 cents, which is a really good deal because they are regularly $2.99. And then I had found before little hang tags on them that were for 50 cents off of one, so it dropped these down to 49 cents each. I picked up two and mixed and matched them for that. No coupons on the Crisco, although it does have like a hang tag for the shortening, but they are 99 cents with the buy four, save four, and that is a really good deal. So I picked up one vegetable oil and one canola oil. Then I did the deal on finish. Again, it is part of the buy four, save four. After that, they are $3.99. I used the $2 off of one coupon. So it made it $1.99 for the 32 count, which is a pretty good deal. So I picked up four of those. The Buttig is 69 cents this week. I picked up five of them and used the $1 off of five. So I paid $2.45 for the five of them, which makes them 49 cents per package. And these are the two ounce packages. I did a deal on the Kraft cheese and I was really excited about this deal. I almost wish I had bought more. So the Kraft cheese is $1.49 after the buy four, save four. And we have $2 off of two coupons from coupons.com. So 79 cents per bag of cheese is a super awesome stock up price. Then Juicy Juice deal. Juicy Juice is 99 cents after the buy four, save four. I had 75 cent off of one coupons. I think it was from the same inserts that a lot of people have the 55 cent off of one, but I ordered inserts that week, I believe. So I got 75 cent off of one and they were 24 cents per bottle. And these are the 64 ounce. So 24 cents is a super, super awesome deal. So I got five bottles. Then I did the Quaker deal. The Quakers are a dollar and 49 cents after the buy for it, save for. I used the $2 off of three coupons. So that made them like 87 cents a piece or something like that. It's like 250 for the three of them. So not a bad deal there. The brown berry bread wasn't a super special deal. It was $2.99 on sale and I used the 55 cent off of one coupon. Bread is just something that I like to keep around because I go through a lot of it. So I picked that up. The stay free was actually a freebie. It is $1.49 after the buy four, save four. We have $3 off of two coupons from coupons.com. So it makes that completely free. 
Then at the other deals are just vegetable deals. I picked up some collards and I picked up some kale. They were both 69 cents per bundle. Um, I did some romaine lettuce that was 99 cents for a head of lettuce. The apples were supposed to be 99 cents per pound. They rang up higher. So I'm a little disappointed about that. I might have to take my receipt back later. Um, but that was that. Then I got some jalapenos and the onions were $1.99. So the produce was mostly the stuff I needed. Kind of everything else was the coupon deals. But yeah, so about $60 for everything, including tax, was not a bad deal. Like I said, I saved $56.30. So I'm not complaining there. A little higher than my normal weekly grocery hauls, but I got a lot out of it and things that will last me a while. Like I will freeze that chicken. It'll last me a long time. Pizzas will be four different meals. So I think it was a pretty good haul this week. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I know you've been requesting a grocery haul. So this is kind of, this is more than I would normally get, but pretty awesome week. So I will see you guys tomorrow for my CVS haul. Bye.